As structural engineers, we have three main performance objectives. The first is safety. So we need to make sure that our minimum probable strength is greater than our maximum probable loads. So we need to make sure that our structure is going to stand up. Our second objective is that our structure must be serviceable, so serviceability. So this falls into two categories. It first must be functional. So this means that we need to uh, limit our deflections, our deflections. Uh, we need to limit vibrations in the building. And we also need to uh, limit our cracking. Cracking scares people and it lets water in. And this leads us to our second point, which uh, in order for it to be serviceable, it also needs to be uh, durable. So functional and durable. So durability, we need to um, limit our cracking. Uh, we need to limit our exposure. And also, we can use better materials. So the better materials could be, uh, for us, we could use ultra-high performance concrete, which is <laughs> essentially impermeable. Or we could also use uh, different non-corrosive uh, reinforcement, like uh, FRP. Um, finally, this leads into uh, our third requirement, which is economy. So our structure must be cheap. It must be an efficient design. Uh, and we also need practical construction. In the U.S., one of the main costs is construction costs, so we need to think of constructability when designing our structure. So these are the three main performance objectives um, as we figure out what, uh, what design is most practical.